Welcome to Hotel Transylvania! Geronimo! <laughs> Uh-oh, look out. Human. We're probably pushing the technology limits of animation. I know that the animators technology-wise had to come up with some tools to accommodate, you know, Gendy's style and the way Gendy likes to work. The computer is just a tool, so it really should do whatever we want it to, just like a pencil, you know? And so that's the philosophy. I don't know, I don't know if they were happy about that philosophy, but that's the philosophy that I came in with. It was like, look, it's just another tool set. We should make it do whatever we want it to do. Overall, the time spent on creating the tools and the technology have enabled us to get more out of our animation. Humans hate us, they're vicious, and they're very loud! In CG animation, you're kind of just using a puppet. We've, we've kind of broken the strings of our puppet and we're able to mold him, and so really, what everybody's doing, the animators, they're kind of drawing, rather than just kind of moving things around and shaping it. That was trippy. Sony Pictures animation style is to not have a house style. We basically hire directors for the movie. Do the thing, y'all! Bada bing, y'all! Gonna knock you right out of that ring, y'all! Johnny? The animation style really came from something that I've loved my whole career. Based around funny drawings and funny movement and nothing realistic. That sounds spot on. In CG movies, people kind of expect what they're gonna go see. Where I think this, they'll be kind of blown away because we've gone to where animation hasn't really gone. Good observation. Speaking of awesome, that cape thing is killing it! It's either, you know, from uh, the type of jokes that we do. Oh! Why did that hurt me? Or the type of animation that we do. It's really gonna take people by surprise, I think.